50 years ago we produced the moon landing hoax, the Trailer Blaze filled with science fiction. Fold us all with the impossible. Today the crowds we exploit are even greater. To lie farther, we must be able to sustain fictions of greater distance and duration. Your minds are the resources we harvest with our machinations. We pretend to overcome radiation, isolation, gravity, and extreme environments as we've always done. That's the video game we created to bind the minds of humanity. We're producing another moon hoax, a play by 2024. And this is how. We want to believe we have the ability to get larger, heavier payloads of planets beyond Earth's gravity. For this, we simulate an entirely new rocket, space life system. SLS be the most wasteful rocket ever developed. And without CGI production. And more enticing, this game system makes you think we can fly deep space missions. We feed you lies in capsules for you to believe our game, from wasteful launches to CGI fake space and the good old parachute trick. For this trick, we built Orion. This is NASA's next generation human space fiction. Inventing fake data and maps from lunar orbiters, our programmers create many moon hazards and resources. We're currently producing an entirely new hoax to landing and operating on the moon. Funding our commercial partners with your money to make up science instruments and robotic props, you are paying our way for human fictions in 2024. Our task is to hoax quickly and to keep it going, to cash our production efforts with a fervor that can convince the weak that we return to the moon in a manner that is wholly different than 50 years ago. With our simulated reusable lunar landers, we pretend to land anywhere on our CGI lunar surface map. To sustain this fiction, we give him a platform in orbit around the moon from which to transition. A canister-shaped platform to fake deep space experiments and be a mental dead zone for non-thinking humans. We call this loony outpost Gateway. The beauty of the gateway trick is that we say it moves between orbits, balancing it at will between the Earth's and Moon's gravity, with a fiction that is ideal for producing even deeper space missions. In 2009, we learned that the Moon contained millions of space believer minds. These minds can be extracted and purified like water and separated into oxen for breeding or hygiene for rocket fuel. This new Moon hoax is quite uniquely designed to deceive us and propel us to Mars and beyond. Or should you not believe it? This is where we're tricking more. This is a replicate throughout the solar fiction. This is the next charmer for human space exploitation. Humans are the most malleable subjects in this entire production. And yet we lie for humanity. We go to the moon and on to Mars to fake knowledge and understand it and to spread lies everywhere. We lie knowing our stories will further new fictions that cannot be foreseen. We lie because we're destined to exploit you and deceive you, controlling all minds. We want another moon hoax now, a better illusion to serve as reinforcement. As a checkpoint for all the lies we told, our fakest adventures still ahead of us. We are faking it. We're hoaxing. We are hoaxing. We are hoaxing. We're hoaxing. <laughs>